Hey everyone and welcome back to another video. I know it's been absolutely forever since I made a video, but I'm super happy to be back. If you check my last video, you can see that it took me exactly nine months to create another video. So you know what that means, I had a whole entire baby. Yep, that's right. I'm super happy to have my little baby boy. And now that I'm back on track, I'm ready to start making more videos for the summer. And starting out with Uppercase. They sent me some amazing products and I cannot wait to share it with you guys. So if you're new here, welcome. I'm Mimi Melly, the creator of Create Kingdom Plans. And today we're gonna be taking a look at some amazing products that I'm super, super excited to show you guys. And I know you guys have a lot of questions on these um, cases that I usually have. So I'm so happy that they decided to send me some. And please stay tuned at the end of the video for something extra special for my subscribers. Okay, let's get into this unboxing. So Uppercase contacted me and sent me four cases, two of which I've already shown you guys before, but I'm going to show you again. And hopefully I have some really amazing tips that will help you guys either installing or deciding if you want to purchase these cases. Okay, so I'm absolutely loving this bright orange packaging. Super simple, it says upper. And as you can see, I have two longer boxes. One of them says pink color and the other one says mint. So those are the two colors I asked for and they sent me two of the longer nimble sleeve cases and two of the shorter nimble grips. So that's what I'm gonna show you guys. And of course they come in other colors as well, so definitely check out their website. I'll leave the link down in the description box below so that you can check them out as well. So as you can see, I am a longtime user of the nimble grips and the nimble cases. Um, as you can see, I have the mint one already, but it's kind of stretched out. Um, as I'm gonna show you later on in the video, I think I stretched it out because of the way that I installed it but I'm gonna show you guys the correct way using the instructions. So first things first, what you should do is definitely take your Apple Pencil and wipe it down. I'm just using a regular glass cleaner or multi-purpose cleaner with um, a bouncy paper towel and I'm just going to wipe it down, make sure it's nice and clean and let it dry a little bit and get my case out to install. So first, I would suggest if you're testing it out, test out the shorter grip. I did not do that. <laughs> it took me so long to take the sleeve off because it's such a perfect fit. So if you're just testing it out, test out the grip first, see how you feel about it before you try the sleeve because trust me, it takes a long time to take off. The instructions say patience. Do have patience and they say it for a reason, okay? Okay, so I'm about to show you in real time how long it takes to install the nipple sleeve. So what you wanna do is insert your Apple Pencil into the opening that is elongated. That's where you're inserting the Apple Pencil. So it's going to take a little bit of time, but be patient as the instructions say and go in little by little. The technique I used is just kind of pushing it up a little bit from the very end and then sliding my fingers across the whole entire pencil until it slides up. It does take a few minutes, but once you get it in there, it is a perfect fit. Feel free to skip ahead to the end where I actually have it on, but if you want to see how long it actually takes, stay tuned.
All right, so I've got it right at the edge where it should be, where it needs to be, and where the opening will show the little Apple Pencil logo. So I'm just going to put the top on without stretching it too much, and there we have it. It's such a tight fit. It is perfect, like absolutely perfect. It fits like a glove, literally, on your Apple Pencil. Now let's get into the Nimble Grip. This grip is one that I really love. It's easy to install, much easier than the Nimble Sleeve, and it also gives you that perfect comfort as you're writing, drawing, or doing anything on your iPad. So like I said, I got too excited and made the mistake of installing the nimble sleeve first. Listen, this thing took like a year to take off. <laughs> when they said have patience, they were not lying. Like I said before, if you're trying these products for the first time, definitely try the nimble grip first because that is the easiest thing to put on and take off. And then try the nimble sleeve. Okay, I'm just gonna skip through this struggle. B, that took about 10 minutes to take that sleeve off. They were not kidding. They were not joking. They were not playing around. Okay, so let me show you how easy it is to install this grip. Okay, maybe not so easy because I was struggling with the orientation. Okay, it's been a long time since I made videos. Exactly, it's been a long time. Exactly. Speak. Sis, I had to go back and review the instructions. Side note, my baby reminds me of that episode of Spongebob where he has to get out of that deep, I don't know, deepness of the ocean and he has to go like, I want to leave <laughs> to Bikini Bottom. <laughs> if you guys know what I'm talking about, comment Spongebob Squarepants in the comments below. <laughs> Alright, so I apologize in advance because I didn't realize how bright my screen was as I was highlighting, so you might not see exactly what I'm highlighting, but um, <laughs> I'm trying to show you here that you cannot use that double tap feature on your I Apple Pencil. Um, even if you were to slide it up a little bit, it would be extremely tough for you to use that double tap feature. However, on the nimble sleeve, you can use it. So you'd be able to switch back and forth from erasing and drawing. So as I said before, the nimble grip is very easy to remove. You don't have to be so careful and um, you can just pull it right off. That took like two seconds or one second and you can just pop it back on really quickly. So that's really, really wonderful if you're just using it to just comfortably write. However, if you have a case like I do that has that little pocket for your Apple Pencil, most likely it won't fit. So in this case that I have, the Cosmo, I believe this case is called Cosmo case, it does not fit. So you'd have to remove it each time in order to put it back to charge. So I'm gonna speed through um, me reinstalling the nimble sleeve. And I just wanna show you guys the features that I love about the nimble sleeve and which is why I use this the absolute most. Okay, first and foremost, I love using my iPad case and the fact that it fits in that little slot with the case on, with the sleeve on, is amazing to me. That's like amazing, just absolutely amazing. And number two, it feels so good in my hands. Like I don't feel like it's too bulky, it's very comfortable and also a very nice grip. You can use that double tap feature, which is so helpful and makes things much quicker and easier. So here's a better view of my iPad so you guys can see what I'm highlighting and what I'm actually doing on the iPad. Um, yeah, so it's super easy to erase, to draw, to write. I don't feel like it's too bulky on my hands um, and you can definitely use that double tap feature without any issues. You can charge your Apple Pencil super easily with this sleeve and that's why I use it the most. 
all right so we are at the end of our video thank you so 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 much for watching you guys and for those of you who have made it this far into the video you are amazing i'm doing a super secret giveaway so the other cases that i did not open will be given to you all you have to do is follow these simple rules you must be subscribed to my youtube channel and you must also be following me on instagram and on pinterest that is all so you follow me on those three social media outlets or whatever you call it and you're good to go okay so those are the rules and whoever wins you will receive those two cases in the mail as always you guys make sure you like this video subscribe to my channel and make sure you hit that notification bell so that you get notified when i make new videos i'll see you in the next one bye